Most people in America are looking for, how do I make a life worth living and return with having? We do that by recognizing America Inc. And America Inc. is basically founded on manufacturing companies and retail establishments. We all know the manufacturing chain, don't we? We all studied that in our initial business classes in high school and college. We get how products are produced, don't we? And we get how they come to our home and our family. But what I'm curious about today is whether or not we can keep our retail employees. What I'm also curious about today is what are we doing in our elementary education, our junior high education especially, and helping to steer children who are really geared towards retail environments. You see, every place around this community, I see signs for people like me and others who are job hunting. And they're trying to entice people, encourage people to be hired into the retail establishments of our world. The strip malls, like the stuff behind me, and the restaurants that are across the street on all sides of me. The challenge is I'm not seeing that happen. I'm also realizing that there's a marvelous college just across town, but there's plenty of young women and men who are living on their mother and father's dime. Isn't that true? and possibly some part-time work during their high school years. But the reality is we have to teach people life balance. And life balance is about serving our needs, but also serving other people's needs. So when I'm working on this reporting conversation with you, I'm asking you, what are you doing to help steer children around you into the appropriate work for themselves so that they're not bored, so they're not mad, and they're, so they're not underserved in their life today?